So guys, this is the state of our roads. So guys, here comes the river. Here comes the river here. This is the river. And this is sand that uh, can scoop from this river. This is it. The water is very dirty, if you can see. The water is very dirty because of the rain. That turn off and mud. That's why the water is so dirty. And if you can remember, from the last time I was here, the forum has increased. The last time the forum was so small, but now, if a child then can see in here, there's a likelihood that he or she might drown. Yeah, so this is the river. Yeah, so I'm going this direction. We have some cows here right there. Typical African cows. So guys here, we have a field that has been prepared. But if you can see, we have so much water, but the races have been dark so that the water is drained. So you can see that it's a field. I don't know if they are going to plant sugar cane or what. So much. The soil is water lodged. The clay soils, no clay soils has high water retention power. That's why we've got this stagnant water right there. And this way, I think, suitable for the growing of rice. Guys, I'm climbing this. I'm climbing up this road to Nyamarambe. And I don't know if today's going to rain, but I just continue. So, in the comment sections, guys, you can let me know if there was experience in high amount of rain as we do in this place green africa You see that guys? That's a motorcycle. It is the most reused mean of transport here in Kenya. Okay, it's the most widespread 
almost everywhere you would go you are going to encounter it okay people usually provide because it's so convenient so convenient in the sense that they can take you to the exact point that maybe you wanted to go compared to maybe a matato you know matatos have designated points where they can drop you but with this they can take you to where you wanna go so it's the most used means of transport here in Kenya and it's very helpful to the youths because in a way that solved unemployment and also in a way that's reduced the crime rates you get that someone who crab maybe gone and rope somewhere is 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 doing this is driving okay cycling it's riding so it's very handy it's very handy in Kenya with a very old building right there a very old building yes we are having a bull of water on the road so let's see where so we have a body right there and that's water everywhere so that's that's the state of this road I don't know if you come with your motorcycle it will be very difficult for you so these roads are so bad they are so bad to your car right there yeah. These are our roads. These are they are right here. They are in a very bad state. I think the government may look into this and maybe do something. So these are the shops, guys. These are typical shops right here. They are usually very small because mostly you find that. The amount of capture that these people that want to start fish is too small, that's why we have so small shops right there. So this is in Yamarambe town. So guys stay tuned. Let me be sure to watch this video to the end. I was with Emma and Sungo, he's playing something, so I'm just waiting for her. I'm just in there. Yes.